Hey guys, welcome to another video here at Cloud Colubrids. Right now, Pumpkin is laying eggs. We're gonna do a nice video. I'm gonna show you her eggs along with the other Oka tea eggs that I have. But in this video, you like California king snakes? I'm gonna show you all my 2022 breeding project plans that I'm gonna be having for my California king snakes. I'll show you the pairings. It's gonna be a great video, a lot of eye candy, so stay tuned. So I want to thank you guys for joining me here. I'm about to show you all of my California king snake breeding projects for 2022. And I'm going to start it off with this beautiful male right here, or I should say handsome, Shadow 2018 California king snake. And the person that I bought him from did not breed him and she didn't know the genetics so he might have some hidden components like albinism or hypo but we don't know but either way he's a beautiful snake really clean clean jet black pattern has a nice glistening as he moves in the natural sunlight and i'm going to be pairing him with this next female that i'm about to show you just an amazing pairing this is going to be So check out this beautiful 2019 girl. She'll be pairing with Shadow and her name is Raven. She also has a real pretty, pretty pattern. Nice streamlined bands. Her color is a little bit more brown, hypo-y compared to Shadow who's just straight jet black. So I don't know if she's got any hidden genetics in her either. And I think they're gonna make a really, really nice pairing. I can't wait to see what they produce. So up next, my high white 6040 Cali King, Edge. Edge was born in 2019, and he's just got a nice clean pattern, nice clean whites, nice sharp blacks. And you can see he has slight, like a slight checkerboard look towards the center of his pattern. And here's the one, the only, Xena. She's gonna be pairing with Edge next season. Xena, she's the same like Edge. She loves to eat. She's gonna be three years old next year. And it's gonna be my first year breeding California king snakes. My first year breeding king snakes, period. Cause this year I bred corn snakes only. I started off nice and subtle. So next year is gonna be interesting. I hope I don't have to play referee. I heard many stories where the females try and eat the males, but uh, with that said, check out Scorpion. Scorpion is 100% Het Palmer Ghost and Amel. So I, I can't wait to see what these produce because I'm going to show you a beautiful female that I'll be pairing him with. I got him from Clayton Carlisle at Mesozoic Reptiles. And he's just got this fierce look. Check out that, that head pattern. Just an amazing, amazing snake. And next, I'm gonna introduce you to his wife. Hopefully, they don't get a divorce. And this is Cleopatra. Cleopatra also has that beautiful look in her face with a little bit of a banana look. Now, I also picked up Cleopatra from Clayton Carlisle at Mesozoic Reptiles, and she is het for ghost and amel. Now, next, I wanna introduce you to Apollo. 
Now he is an ink drop pattern, California King Snake, and I picked him up in 2019 from Don Shores. Now you can't breed for that ink drop pattern. It's more like a random thing. I've been trying to find a female that has the same pattern, but they're very hard to come by. So I'm gonna probably pair him with another female high white Cali King that I did not show in this video. But I'm hoping that I can produce a couple of these and include the albino gene. I love albino ink drops. Now next I wanna introduce you to Sapphire. Sapphire is a 2019 Blue Eyed Lavender and I picked her up from the one and only Tom Stevens. He produces some of the most amazing California King Snakes and this was actually the first King Snake I picked up from Tom Stevens. I fell in love with it. It was the first time I ever seen the Blue Eyed Lavender and since then it's one of my favorite genes. Now next I'm gonna show you the male I'll be pairing her with but something about these, it's really hard to pick up on camera how beautiful they are. The pattern is so subtle and as you move it in different lights, the shades come dark to light. There's a glistening in the pattern and beautiful blue eyes also hard to pick up on the camera. So I can't wait to pair these and this is gonna be her mate, Minotaur. Blue Eyed Lavender, nice zigzag pattern on the tail. They're gonna make some beautiful babies. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you do, like, comment, and remember to subscribe and support the channel. Be safe, guys. I'll catch you in the next one.